Hello and welcome to the Fantasy Masterclass and Fantasy video of the India Women vs England Women Series Tied 1-1. First match, England all over India. Sophie Dunkley, Alice Capsi, easy batting performance, 130 for 1 after the Indian uh, women did not post a very challenging total, but Derby. Derby is always favorable to the Indians. 171 from Harman, that delivery from Julan, all of those fond memories and Shmiti Mandana was absolutely brilliant. Absolutely brilliant Shmiti Mandana. India, easy win. Easy win, snare runner, multiple wickets. So how do I look at the third and uh, important uh, match in this particular series? I think it's even Steven slightly because of uh, England uh, home conditions, I will pick them ahead, but there is always the Shmriti Mandana factor. So 6-5 for me for England. Richard Ghosh for Amy Jones because Richard Ghosh can give me those power hits. Perhaps Amy Jones is slightly under pressure. Shmriti Mandana, leadership potential. Harman Preet Kaur, Shmriti Mandana straight away come in from the Indian side. I will go with Sophie Dunkley and Alice Capsi from among the England batting order. So that's five. In the middle, Deepti Sharma and Snehrana from India. Uh, I will not take Bryony Smith. And then in the bowling, I'll go with uh, Sarah Glenn, Sophie Eccleston, and of course, Frey Davis. So all three from, from, from England there. So that's how my team is looking for this particular match. Once again, Sophie Dunkley. Uh, you can also go with Danny Wyatt and uh, Alice Capsi from England. So I've gone with the top order. Then I've gone with Smriti Mandana and Harman Preet Kaur with Richard Ghosh. So that's 3-3. Three, three. Deepti Sharma, Sneha Rana, Frey Davis, Sarah Glenn, Sophie Eccleston. And the last one is basically a toss-up. That toss-up, I will actually go the England route. Uh, Six five England is what I will I will want, but you follow the toss. Three cardinal principles of fantasy: look at the toss, look at the conditions, no emotion whatsoever. Then take your team. At this point in time, I am going with six five England. Once I see the toss, once I see the conditions, once I hear the pitch report, once I get details of the pitch report, it might change. But at this point in time, this is what I am going with. I will again update my fantasy team leadership potential. Going with the Shmriti Mandana, going with the Sophie Dunkley or Alice Katsi. Alice Katsi is not bold. The last time was a run out. Alice Katsi, definitely a leadership material. Tremendous potential according to Marizan Kapp and Mithali Raj. So Katsi and Mandana, Mandana and Katsi can be a good, good pair. Deepti Sharma, a safe bet. Uh, Sarah Glenn has bowled very well. These are your other options. If you want to play the, 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 the Grand League, then you try an Alice Katsi and maybe someone like a Sarah Glenn. If you're trying a small league, uh, you know, rather if you're, you know, that's where you, you make experiments. That's where you go, uh, uh, you know, with, with an experiment. And, and when you play the, you, you want to take a punt, you can go in with a Shmiti Mandana and an Alice Capsi combination. I hope this benefits you in terms of fantasy. And again, I will be back tonight before the match starts after the toss, updating my team. All the very best.